Hey, what is going on, vegans and raw vegans? One of the easiest rebuttals is somebody wants to argue with you about, oh my God, you can't get that nutrient on a vegan diet because that nutrient only comes from animals. If anyone ever says that to you, then you can just say, I totally agree. That nutrient only comes from animals. And me being an animal, I produce that nutrient. Same way cows produce nutrients and pigs produce nutrients and chickens produce nutrients and, and wild boar produce nutrients, so does the human body. We produce nutrients because we are also animals. So if you can only get a nutrient on, sorry, if you can only get a nutrient from an animal, well, you're an animal, so your body produces that nutrient. So that's all you need to say. That's it. If you eat the same food that these animals eat, you know, more or less, you're going to uh, produce the same nutrients. So don't worry about whenever someone says something like that. Just agree with them and let them know that you're a human as well. And uh, if you need to supplement, there's no shame in supplementation. There should be no shame in supplementing. If you need to supplement with B12, do it. If you don't know if you need to supplement with B12, do it anyway. It doesn't matter. Like, you're better safe than sorry. Like, What's the worst that's going to happen? Your body's going to have a little excess B12. Like, there's no worries to, to supplementing something like that. Now, things like iodine, for example. Okay, you got to be a bit cautious about that. Don't want to have too much iodine. But things like B12, things like vitamin D, things like vitamin C. Like, for the most part, vitamins and minerals, you can supplement with them. And you're going to be all good. There's no, like, really negative side effects to them. Iodine being one of the rare cases there, but do your research on a supplement. Take it if you want, don't take it if you don't want it. And uh, don't be worried about not getting all your nutrients on a whole food plant-based diet. As long as you're eating a big variety of fruits and vegetables, you're eating all the colors of the rainbow, you're gonna be good. You're not gonna be deficient in anything. And as long as you're getting enough calories. If you under eat on calories, you're gonna be under underdoing the uh, amount of nutrients you get as well. So get enough calories in, aim for about 15, 16, 17 calories per pound of body weight. If you're trying to maintain your weight, and if you're trying to lose weight, aim for about 13, 12 calories per pound of body weight. If you're trying to gain weight, aim for about 20 plus calories per pound of body weight. And you're gonna be getting all your nutrients, you're gonna be getting all your protein, you're gonna be getting everything you need just from a whole food plant-based diet. Don't worry about what people say about not getting in enough nutrients, especially if you're eating organic. Especially if you're eating organic, especially if you're eating a lot of raw fruits and vegetables, and you're getting, like I said, all the colors of the rainbow. So that's it for now. Peace out, much love, and uh, don't worry about it. I've been vegan for over 11 years now, and I'm doing great. All right, cheers. Bye for now.